Hey Libra, thank you guys so much for tuning back into the channel. Let's clear the energy, sending you guys peace, love, light, and protection. Please take these messages as they resonate with you. Leave behind with this night. Okay, let's see what's going on with you, Libra. Hold on, clear some of the dust a little bit. All right. Let's see what's going on with Libra at this time, Divine. Excuse my daughter laughing in the background, y'all. They could have been... It could be people laughing at you in the background or something. Or used to laugh at you in the background. Or it ain't nothing funny. Let's see here. What's going on with the Libra? Okay. Fulfillment of wishes. Okay, so someone's getting their wishes granted here. Congratulations. Temptation at the bottom of the deck. It's like the Nine of Pentacles. Fertility. Someone could be pregnant. Get some more here. Triumph. Oh. Conflict and defeat. That's the energy of somebody laughing at you in the background. Hold on, let me yeah, cover back a little bit. <laughs> okay. What's going on? Okay, love begins right up under fulfillment of wishes. Someone could be married with a beautiful family. Someone loves themselves. We have suffering and silence with foundation and achievements coming out. 919 could be significant. Four, three, seven, five. Let's get one more. Like he's seeing temptation. Someone is so tempted to get at you. Harmony. For well, right on top of love begins. So this could be like a crazy ex or something. Moving on at the bottom of the deck, child. Was that sacrifice I just seen? Or just solitude? We got moving on. So, you're dealing with a scorn lover here. Someone's dealing with a scorn lover. This could be a baby father or something. Hmm. Let me clarify for you guys. I'm seeing someone here like, you're in the energy of taking care of yourself. You know, everything that you want is basically coming in. You're being devoured with love right now. Like, so, yeah, you could have got, you could, you could, you, this is an X. But with this harmony being under conflict and defeat, I feel like y'all went y'all separate ways somewhere in, in here between this triumph and suffering and silence. This could be you with the suffering and silence. Like at one point in time, somebody had you all in your head while they was out doing whatever they wanted to do. This is a man, this is a woman in the picture. Yeah, I don't know, like it's something like that. It's something like that, let's see here. Clarify fulfillment of wishes for Libra. Nine of Wands, 999 is definitely significant here. What's the Nine of Wands? Yeah, this Nine of Wands is looking back to the past. With the Six of Cups at the bottom. Definitely somebody from the past. Eight of Cups. You walked away from a lover here. Someone you thought you should always be with. Someone's looking back at why you walked away from them. Someone is really reminiscing about you. This could definitely be somebody's baby father. Could definitely be. What's the Eight of Cups? With the world, child. Yeah. 
someone's focus. They're not with the stars. Someone's focused. Someone is not worried about being with another person. What's this fertility? Or maybe you want a family, but this person, like, they're not family material. Wheel of Fortune. What's the Wheel of Fortune? Something about to take off for another person. What's the Wheel of Fortune? Eight of Swords. Yeah, you go to Eight of Wands. With the Empress at the bottom of the deck. Chariot. Yeah, something's about to take off for another person. This is like, this is not so much as the one that got away. This is a lover here who didn't take you serious. And now you're stepping into some type of spotlight, it feels like, or something. Or you just, you're happier now. You look better. You feel better. People can see this. They see a difference within you. Especially whoever this is. What's the Eight of Swords? Someone's stuck on you with the moon. Yeah, someone from your past is stuck on you, basically. And your loving energy. Like, you're wife material here. You're definitely, I'm definitely getting feminine energy. You're wife material. Someone is able to build a, a family with you. We got the King of Swords with the King of Cups. Hmm. What's this triumph? Two of Swords. What's the Two of Swords? Somebody tried to block you from moving on. Knight of Swords. With the Queen of Pentacles. Someone could try to block you from moving on, from uh, leaving now. See, now somebody gives me narcissist vibes. What's the Two of Swords, Knight of Swords? Five of Wands. With the judgment and the sun. Yeah, someone's being judged here. Someone like... Somebody here wanted you to suffer. This is a scorn lover here. Like, someone they could, like... Like, when y'all break up or something like that, they get they people to, like, taunt you. They threaten to fight, threaten to do this, do that. Y'all fought a lot. And when y'all fought, this person went out and did their thing and had you wondering what they was doing. What's this conflict and defeat? Wait, now this person is upset because I feel like you moved on and you in a new relationship. Yeah, four wands. This is the four of wands right here. You moved on and you in a whole new relationship. I said it's about you being happy. King of Swords again. Yeah. You could be dealing with uh, another Libra or Gemini Aquarius. Someone is defeated. They, they, they don't like the fact that you're moving on. You're more stable. And you got a lot of offers of love coming in if you're not snatched up already. What's the four of wands? See, this person thinking back to when... They was in a four of wands energy with you. What's the four of wands? Nine of pentacles. And they go to nine of pentacles right here. Whoa. It's almost as if like you was wish fulfillment for another person. But they go to... It's like you was wish fulfillment for somebody. Like this person's like trying to turn you into somebody that you wasn't. I don't know. You just wasn't happy with another person, whoever this is. Not a lot of nines out here. Something about nine. September. Nine eleven. Like y'all could have like, I don't know. But this person is defeated because you feel whole without them. What's this love begins? High priestess. What's a high priestess? the devil yeah somebody tried to bind you to them by playing mind games with you somebody only wanted to bind you to them what's the double by playing mind games page of swords seven of swords they knew exactly what they was doing this person tried to turn you into what fit for them the empress almost uh, no, the empress did come out on oh, no, this page of pentacles they go to empress right there yeah someone is like into divination a high priestess with the page of pentacles right here Someone's into divination. Someone do love spell on people. This person tried to do a love spell on you. What's the devil with the page of pentacles? Somebody was only with you, yep, because of your abundant energy. Somebody was only 
with you because of your abundant energy. And they wanted this four of wands, nine of pentacles with you. I feel like they did have it with you at one point in time, but it wasn't like where, where it is right now or where it's going to be for you in the future with somebody else. Overall, this person can't get you, can't get over you. And they ain't got nothing to offer you. They just want control. Somebody's obsessed with you. What's this foundation achievements? Four of swords. Four, four, four. And nine, nine, nine is significant. What's the four of swords? We got the queen of swords. Yeah, this is what you want. You want a stable family. Ten of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Nine of swords. Nine of cups. All these nines. With the ten of cups. Nine to the ten of cups. You wanted a stable family. But this person can offer you a stable family. Who this queen of swords? This is you and this queen of swords energy. You just already knew this person was not going to be it. The king of cups. What's this suffering in silence? Six of Swords. Someone is suffering because you moved on. You moved on. What's the Six of Swords? With the Five of Cups. This person is sad. With the Lovers at the bottom. Yeah, someone's very sad over you. What's this Harmony? Did somebody just was not for you? Ten of Pentacles. You have a whole family with another person, and this person is so mad. What's the Ten of Pentacles? They mad you don't want it with them. Ten of Swords. Ten, ten is significant. With the Three of Wands, this person is watching you build the Ten of Pentacles with somebody else, and they are devastated. But they're thinking back when they tried to build something with you, or when you tried to build something with them, I should say, and what it was lacking at. Give me some, okay, let me get one, give me one on this person here I'm picking up on for the collective, a Libra. Look at that. what I say? This person tried to bind you to them. Mm-hmm. what I say? With truth at the bottom of the deck and you found out they true motive. What's, the what's this temptation? I knew it. Ace of Swords, that's clarification, babe. Nine of Swords peeking his face out. What's this Ace of Swords with Temptation? Somebody know you know the truth here about their true motives for even dating you with the Three of Cups. They could even work with a group of people here. This could have been some type of bet to come towards you just to empty your cup with the Nine of Swords. Somebody has been found out by you. This person only dated you to play with you, to toy with you. And it was like, it could have been some type of bet here or something. But let's get an oracle for you, Libra, because this was pretty straightforward, I feel. I feel like lower vibrational people here, like these, like this person, can't get at you no more because you are you know the ins and outs, the tricks to narcissists. This is a narcissist. Even though I didn't really say too much on that topic, that's what this is. What's the oracle here? Yeah, laughing in the background. Laughing in the background, group of friends, but a change in the wind is at the uh, it just came out. I want to get one more than three of cups. What's this three of cups here? I, I said in the beginning something about laughing in the background, and my sister just reminded I mean, child said my sister. <laughs> so, this could be someone that knows your sister here with two of cups and a higher friend coming out. Yeah, this is somebody that knew somebody else you was close to. Like, look at all these people, look at all these people. Yeah, some type of leader here was coercing two, two other people here. Or somebody wanted to get in the way of your love life, so they sent that somebody that was not for you. And it could be your friends or something. Somebody wanted another person to hurt you. What's this change in the wind before I read it? The hermit. What's the hermit? With the six of cups. And king of wands at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, someone's very controlling here. This this double energy here, that's this king of wands. 
This person loves having control over people. Let's read this change in the wind, though. 12. Yeah, somebody was plotting on you here. And I feel like even if you don't know who all the people is that was plotting, you probably thought about a lover here. Hmm. A sense that unseen change has been initiated. Pre preparation for a storm. Awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the wind will blow. It's human nature to yearn for certainty and resist change. To want the world to remain consistent like a zebra stripes. Yet nothing in human experience is black and white, nor will anything remain static. The one thing guaranteed is change. Now is a time of transformation and outer conditions are temporarily moving out of sync with your desires and expectations. Stay the course and remember that even storms serve to clear the air, scatter seeds, and nourish the soul for better things. It's like you have to find yourself again here with the Hermit Six of Cups. You have to find yourself again. In order to make some type of change in this relationship. Because someone tried to like come for you emotionally. This person wants you to suffer on purpose. Yeah. That's basically what I got for you, Libra. I feel like everything has got good for you. Like, you in a whole different situation right now with somebody else, or you about to be. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one, loves. I say, mwah.